This isn't good. Transformers are charging the building, trapping the police inside. Yuri, complicated was an understatement. I'm gonna have to disable these Transformers to free your men. Even if you manage that, they'll still need your help with the demons. That's why I'm here, ready to serve all your electricity and demon-related needs. Webbing should cause them to overheat. I hope. How did they even get that thing attached? And it can't be easy to put four more of these suckers. I did not miss dealing with Electro's elaborate supervillain antics while he was in the raft. Trapping the police with a network of energy transformers? Who does that? Transformer trapping the police is hanging from that helicopter. Wow. Bet you that's the first time anyone has said those particular words in that particular order. The police are free, but demons aren't backing down. Need to lend a hand.
Yuri, your men are safe. What's next? Get to the Upper West Side. We're trying to shelter civilians, but Rhino isn't making it easy. He never does. On my way. Miles left a voicemail. Pete! Hey, Pete! Hey, May wanted me to call you. Things in the Veterans Center are not good. Convicts are trying to break down the doors. Mary Jane's here, but we're getting people out of the basement. We need more help. I hope you can get here soon. I need to finish with the precincts fast and get to Harlem. Dr. Octavius, making quick hit and runs on the city's emergency response teams. right now? Oh, just me? Come on, anybody? 
That's it for Sable's airborne commandos. Now to mop up the rest of the Rikers escapees. Yuri, precinct is secure. And I just found out what it means to be Sable's priority target. Not fun. That'll teach you to piss off international mercenaries. Guess so. Okay, I need to sign off for a bit. Call me if things go south. Will do. And thanks. You've given us a fighting chance. Okay. Need to hustle to feast sister site in Harlem and help May. Peter! Thank God! We need you at the Veterans Center. Where are you? I got held up. Are you okay? What's happening? The convict started a fire. We got the building staff out, but May and Miles are trapped inside. I'm trying to find a way into them, but the fire's spreading so fast. Stay where you are, MJ. I'll handle this. Damn it. Move it, Pete. Move! I don't want to have to rescue you too. Peter, don't be crazy. Wait for help. May! May! Here! We're over here! I got you. Hang on! Hey, May, you alright? Get to the window! <coughs> it's too far! Uh, hold on! Just brace yourselves! <coughs> Come on, you stupid piece of... Come on, May! I've got you! Oh my god. Go! Go! Miles! Come on! No!
Is May okay? Everyone is safe. MJ, if it weren't for you and Miles, I would have been... As dead as I would have been the last eight and a half thousand times you saved me. Pretty sure I still owe you a few. <laughs> That's smart. <laughs> hey. I'm sorry I screwed things up. It's just hard being the one who always gets saved, you know? Sometimes I want to do the saving. I'm sorry I made you feel like you couldn't. Still partners? Always. Huh? Hey. Uh, so I didn't know if, uh, you wanted sparkling or, or flat or spring or mountain spring. So I got one of each. Am I interrupting? No. Um, MJ, Ms. Watson, and I were just talking strategy. Strategy? That's right. The city is in danger. It needs our help. All of our help. All right, well, call the play, coach. Okay. Divide and conquer. Ms. Watson, we need an anti-serum for Devil's Breath. Oscorp's developing something, but there's no way they can keep it safe from Octavius and Lee. We need to find the cure and protect it. I'll chase down some leads. Miles, you need to be my eyes and ears at feast. Anything goes wrong, call me. We need to keep that place and the people there safe. All right, you got it. What are you gonna do? Gang of costume nut jobs is taking the city apart piece by piece. Time I return the favor. All right. All right. Hey, wait. Um, how do I call you? I mean, do you have like a cell phone in your in your po pockets or something? Ms. Watson can give you my number. Good luck, team. You have his number. Are you Spider-Man's girlfriend? That'd be so cool. <laughs> <sighs> Come on, Sherlock. Show me what you got in this water smorgasbord. The city feels a little more under control. Miles is watching Feast, MJ is tracking a Devil's Breath cure. Time for me to focus on finding Otto, and stopping whatever he has planned. Yuri, we need to start tracking the big boys. Still no leads on Octavius? No, nothing. Forensics can't even do a sweep of Times Square. Everyone in that department but the intern is sick. I might be able to turn something up, let you know what I find. Listeners are warning that the mayor's sable agents, ostensibly here to protect us, are behaving more like an occupying army. But let's hear it from the caller. Go ahead. They won't let me in my building. You said it's quarantine. I said, fine, let me in and I'll stay there. They pointed their guns at me, ran me off like a criminal. I got no place to go. Caller, this is deeply disturbing to me. I promise you, I'll bring it to the attention of the proper authorities. Emergencies do not permit the suspension of human rights. Your elected officials may not be willing to fight for you, but J. Jonah Jameson is.
girls are gonna die. Die! Spider-Man, here to lend a hand? Thought you might need one, officer. You don't know the half of it. Never seen anything like this devil's breath stuff. Forensics is having a hell of a time. News reports say this is where Otto released devil's breath. Might have left some residue I can track. Some residue on this sign. Maybe I can isolate it. AT rich leader sequence. This looks promising. Corpse modified CPF-1. Definitely Devil's Breath. Should be able to track the dispersal path now. Trail goes in a few directions. Need to find the right one. How long is it going to be closed for? Really can't say, sir. Freaking <laughs> sweet. Not this way. Should try another vapor trail. Vapor trail heads up that building. Trail leads down into those vents. What's Otto doing up here? Should be a door or an access hatch around here. Well, this is moody. Must be some way to hit the lights. There be light. Whoa. Was Otto using this as a staging ground? Chaos of the prison break would have been perfect cover to move in. Martin Lee. Can't believe this is the same man I knew at feast. Seems like Otto and Lee have more of a history than I thought. How long have they known each other? Looks like Otto recorded messages for his crew. Oh, Martin. When I first realized it was you targeting Osborne these past weeks, I was shocked and saddened. But then, as the situation evolved before my eyes, I felt... inspired. 
You took the bold steps I had always dreamed of, Martin, and you took them without hesitation. I am honored now to join you on this path towards true justice. Otto's rage is driving him. The neural interface is exacerbating it, but his hate is genuine. He'll destroy the whole city to hurt Norman. Otto's been studying Sable's tech for weaknesses. Norman. I feel like I can't turn around without seeing his face. He smiles for the cameras, collects his accolades and keeps his boot heel pressed against my neck. Why can't anyone else see how selfish he is? How reckless? How... evil? If only they could be made to see the Norman I know. The man behind the mask. Oscorp has snaked itself throughout the city. Power, communication, public safety. Norman made his company essential, but also fragile. If a disaster were to occur, and a few small pressure points were tweaked, it would all fall apart. The public would see Norman for what he is, a leech on their lives. Yes, just a few simple steps, and he would be ruined forever. How many men would I need? Well, let's see. First, some kind of disaster. A hurricane, an earthquake, or a plague. Next, assaults on Oscorp's power grid and emergency relief send the city into chaos. Let the people see the truth about Norman. Yes, just a handful of men. No more than a half dozen. A sinister six. Martin has been arrested. Norman looks pleased. Believes he's safe. He has no idea. He's just put all the rotten eggs a man might need into a single basket. With Martin in raft. Alongside Scorpion, Rhino, Vulture, and Electro. A single swift kick is all it would take to send those eggs tumbling down the hill. Straight at Oscorp. And Norman. Yes. Just one small kick. I think it's time for me to lace up my boots and climb the hill. This is my final recording. Peter, if you're listening to this, Please know that I did what I thought was just. It may have been extreme, but when it comes to Norman, half measures will never do. Of all that I risk by taking this next step, the loss of our friendship will pain me the most. I hope that if we meet again, it will not be on opposite sides. Good old Rhino, my second favorite Russian. Otto developed a corrosive to free Rhino from his suit. A certain government agency spent years trying and failing to do that. Only took Otto a few days.
Alexei, I've followed your career with great interest. The world sees you as a witless dullard. I see a warrior with a poet's heart. I know you desire freedom from the battle suit you're sealed inside. Help me achieve my goals, and freedom shall be yours. Mac Gargan, a.k.a. Scorpion, a.k.a. Crazy Pants McCrazy. It's rare for me to admit this, Mr. Gargan. Clearing your debts was more difficult than I anticipated. You're in arrears to some demanding individuals. But once the reservoir job is finished, your financial obligations will be finished as well. Otto Octavius is nothing if not persuasive. Helping Otto in exchange for a clean slate? Criminal record expunged? Gambling debts erased? Old man Vulture. I've tangled with him more than anyone else here. Power source for Vulture's wings gave him spinal cancer. And Otto's developing an experimental treatment to save him. Adrian, what bitter irony that your miraculous wings should have brought such horrors on your body. Thankfully, you are now working for me. When our work is settled, the treatment I've developed will cure you. You won't shuffle off this mortal coil just yet, my friend. Electro. Total live wire, that one. Electro's big pipe dream is to become pure energy. Doc actually managed to modify his harness to get a little closer to that goal. first conveyed your dream to me, I thought you insane. Pure energy. <laughs> but as I dove deeper into the problem, I discovered a way to give us both what we desire. I promise you, when we are done, you will be pure energy. Or so close to it as to make the difference irrelevant. What's this now? UV bulb. Huh, nothing happened. Otto must have used this map to plan, but it's blank. Unless there's something here I'm missing. Must be a way to get that lamp on. <laughs> uh. 
There we go. Hidden markings. Otto's tasked the villains to destroy Oscorp holdings throughout the city. He's trying to take apart Norman's empire piece by piece. Lee's going after the Devil's Breath Antiserum, using something called Icarus? What's Vulture doing in Times Square? I need to keep my guard up. Electro's disabling Oscorp power plants. Makes sense. Seems like the last stage of the plan is a direct assault on Oscorp. And Scorpion must be trying to poison the city's reservoir. Another Oscorp-owned property. Rhino's targeting Oscorp's shoreline properties. Which is he hitting first? And why? Icarus, this is it. Spider-Man. We've never been properly introduced. I'm o Otto Octavius. There is no Icarus, is there? No. Martin needs no assistance to secure the anti-serum. Icarus was a ruse to get you into position. Into position? damage him if I web the transformer. I must break you! You got it! 
You got my joke! I'm so happy I can almost stop fighting! Almost! You gotta be honest, liked it better when you two were loners. A vigor of youth, the wisdom of experience, a fine pairing. Just like oil and water, sure. One to go. How many times have we done this dance, Adrian? A dozen? Two dozen? Once too many. Tonight will be your... Electro's been grounded. Spider-Man, I presume. If you really cared about this city, you'd be helping me expose Osborne for the criminal he is. By killing innocent people? I would have restored the power. You're sick. You need help. I have all the help I need. And we will not stop until Norman gets what he deserves. when they team up. Just need to catch my breath. What time? Oh, man. I need to update Yuri. Yuri, Vulture and Electro are down. Four to go. I saw. Also noticed a rooftop in Times Square exploded. Wouldn't happen to be related, would it? Nothing gets by you. It was Octavius' staging ground. He's using the villains to pull apart Oscorp. Vulture and Electro were targeting power plants. Scorpion's going after water treatment. Not sure about Rhino yet. Something along the shoreline. That's good enough to start. 
I assume you're going after Scorpion? Yeah. City's already on the brink. If we lose clean water, we might never come back. I'll update you when I make progress. Sounds like a plan. I should check on Miles. Hey Pete, you okay? That's what I was gonna ask you. I'm fine, but you and May are in the middle of it. We're busy, but people need help. And I'd rather be doing something than waiting around for somebody else to fix things, you know? Yeah, I heard that. Just make sure you protect yourself. Mask and gloves. And rest every now and then. All that goes double for May. <sighs> Nobody can make that woman take a break when she doesn't want to. But I'll do my best. Thanks, Miles. Give me my love, and be safe. Take a closer look. Now, if I was a mercenary dressed like a scorpion, where would I be? Behind you! Me, I'd end it now. But Octavius is paying, and he wants to torture you, which I respect. Damn it! What did he inject me with? Whoa! What the... Is that... a sea of poison? Can't be! This can't be real. Must be the poison. But I can't take any chances. Gotta get to higher ground, and analyze whatever he injected me with! Should be safe for a minute. I need to analyze the neurotoxin so I can create an antidote. Scorpions made some upgrades. Hallucinogenic neurotoxin. My brain will create nightmares that my body thinks are real. I have to create the antidote fast. First, I need a natural steroid. Extract from an Eclipta Alba plant should do the trick. ESU's greenhouse is nearby. Hope it's in season. Alba should be inside the greenhouse. There it is. Uh, 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 uh. Don't worry. Step uh, Where'd it go? Is this real or in my mind? It can be both.
It's just the hallucinations intensifying. You can get through this. Doc, you sound... Like I did before the neural interface affected my mind? My obsessions were always there, but the interface allowed me to fully embrace them. I have to fix this. Fix you! Somehow! Ah, uh, Peter. Always trying to shoulder the responsibility, even when there's no hope. I can't tell you how many times your unfettered optimism has kept me going when things look bleak. I'll miss being with you. I really will. I'm sorry, Doc. I'm so sorry. Yes, yes, you're sorry. And yet, you let it happen. Makes one wonder where your priorities lie. I mean, if I was really that important, why would you let me destroy myself? I can help you. It's the neural web. It's affecting your mind. You mean the neural web you helped create. The hard truth is you did this to me. Without your help, I would have never done any of those terrible things. I should have seen what was happening to you. Never left you alone with those arms. Good luck. I wish I could offer you more help. Stay strong, Peter. There's the Ecliptolb! I don't buy me time, but I need an antitoxin to mix a permanent antidote. One of Harry's research stations was developing a synthetic atropine. Gotta get there fast. Giant deadly scorpion tails. Lovely. Thanks, brain. Raw panic crawling up your spine. Scorpion? How'd you get this number? Always asking the most interesting questions. It's not how am I calling you? It's Am I calling you? Maybe I'm just the fevered screams of your dying brain. Real or no, when I cure this poison, I'm coming for you, Mac. <laughs> Big talk from the little bug. Research station. We need that atropine. I have to get into the stick. Atropine's right there. It's you, secret safe. The atropine's gone. Oh, not again. You're too late, just as you were too late to help me. This isn't you, Doc. Ah, but it is me. The me polite society found me convenient. The parts of myself I suppressed. But you helped me break those chains. I'm sorry. I'll find a way to help you. I swear it. Stop deluding yourself. You never help anyone. The poison isn't in you. You are the poison. Everyone you touch. I'm sorry. I'll find a way to help you. I swear it. Stop deluding yourself. You never help anyone. The poison isn't in you. You are the poison. Everyone you touch suffers. Stop.
stop running from me! Let me try! I want nothing from you! You're a failure at life, love, career. You bring nothing but pain! No, stop! I'm not giving up on you! Please, just talk to me. I can help you. So you can treat me like all the rest? Containing me? Suffocating me? No, I will let my genius shine on its own. I saw you, Peter, taking notes, stealing ideas, a rat in my own lab. To think I called you a friend. I am your friend, Otto. There it is. The Atropine. to mix up the antidote. Looks like I'm headed back to the lab. You with us? You're nearly cured. Sorry to bust up your plans. Oh, Webs, don't worry. There's plenty of surprises left for you. We'll be able to each other again. Count on it. I need to mix the antidote. Finally. I think not. You're in my domain now. You're just like us. Trying to steal my genius! Everything that happens now is your fault! I knew you were laughing at me! All of you! Behind my back! Don't I give out about you? Scorpion! Are you even real? Hold still. I'll show you. That can be an opening. Another hallucination. At least he had an imaginary glass jaw. I know you're the poison trying to distract me. Bring it on! You're a loser! All you'll ever be is a loser! You can't let him get me. One down! The world would be better off without you! Gotta get rid of him. Gotta. Nice. Just a few more left. So you. Everyone you ever met suffers. It's like another one down. If I was your uncle, I would have jumped in front of a bullet, too! My inner voice has really developed an attitude. Oh, that's the last of them. I can barely stand up. There's the equipment I need. I took decontamination a little too far.
I'd better put some clothes on. Much better. Let's just go ahead and forget that ever happened. So many good memories of working here. All Doc's the smartest man I know. And now he might be the most dangerous. wasn't just reinforcing the arms, he was turning them into weapons. Parker says the interface is dangerous, but the boys at Neophyte never truly created anything. Thinks we can stay on the sidelines, avoiding the mud. Men died to found this nation. They died to get us to the moon. Every great push forward demands blood. And this next push, this push to rid ourselves of Norman stink, it may yet be the bloodiest of them all. Not gonna let that happen, Doc. Parker. Always listening, aren't you? Always observing, memorizing, stealing. Who have you told about the neural interface, hmm? About my work? Well, it stops here, Parker. I trusted you. But instead of recognizing my genius, what did you do? Tried to tear it down! Accused it of flaws. There are no flaws! It's a thing of beauty. A perfect extension of the mind itself into the world. Thought given form by these incredible arms. And I have only one thought on my mind now. Norman's reputation lying in tatters before me. Time to give it shape. He was planning this right under my nose. Was it just an idea in his head until the interface pushed him over the edge? How long was he using the device before I realized? The neural interface is exacerbating Doc's rage. He may not be able to come back from this. Parker says the interface is dangerous, but the boy's a neophyte. Never truly created anything. Thinks we can stay on the sidelines, avoiding the mud. Men died to found the...
Whew. Head's still foggy. Need to work the last of this poison out of my system before I tackle the other villains. Good time to go on patrol. Hey, hey, mind if I toss a kind of thorny ethical question at you? When is it okay to give up on a friend? Oh, wow, Pete. Thinking of Otto? That obvious, huh? Yeah, understandable, though. Man, the high-minded, generous part of me wants to say never. Being a true friend means being there, even when people lose their way. But with what Otto's done, I just don't know, Pete. I guess you have to decide if the Otto Octavius you knew was still in there or not. Maybe if he was ever even in there at all. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, MJ. I gotta process some stuff, I think. Call me anytime, Pete. I'm here for you.
Nice weather, huh? Done to help us. Some hero you've been. I'm glad you're still here. Okay, I need to get after Scorpion, but I haven't seen Aunt May face to face since the fire. I think I can afford a quick pit stop at Feast. Right over here. Until Miles gets back, the best thing we can do is keep everyone fed. Oh, Peter, it is so good to see you. How are you? Healthy? I'm good. How are you holding up, May? Good, but busy. Oh, let me go. <coughs> oh. oh, there. <coughs> I'm okay. Didn't you tell me something once about accepting that I'm human just like everyone else? You and Ben. <coughs> Masters at turning my own words against me. I am fine, Peter. Just a little rundown. Where's Miles? Could he help out? Oh, he is. He's off picking up medical supplies from the relief center. It's amazing how quickly we go through antibiotics. Okay. You stay off your feet for a bit. I'll organize the unloading and check in with Miles. Deal? Deal. Give me a chance to nurse my wounded Parker pride. Come on, Miles, answer. Don't make me worry about you and me. Because he made one stupid crack about the guy's suit. Freaking intense. Dude's gonna hurt something. Need to distract him. Hacking app should work. Hey. Okay, that did it. Not even local. Should be able to hop that wall. <clears throat> Medical containers in that tent. Maybe this will be easy. You see the way he came through here? I heard that. Like an animal. Both of them are. But they're on our side. You two, get over here. All right, all right, all right. I heard that. Nothing sweeter than seeing cops run. Gaz? 
Iodine, but no antibiotics. I need to keep looking. Locations and schedules for your supply runs. I don't have that information. More supplies over there. I hate watching. Need to get past these guys. Turns my stomach in there. Just give us the info. Stop. Five by five control. Don't have clearance for that. Uh, that's not what Benson wants to hear. Stupid tin man! I'm tripping. I heard that. Another supply tent. Oh, crossing fingers. A couple trauma kits. No antibiotics. Gotta be somewhere. short us. Bro, relax. Everybody gets a take. Nobody's trying to short you. Dude, please don't... Gotta avoid that sniper. Chill, please. Who's there? Oh, come on, Kurt. 
great be the one. Mox is selling. Perfect. That is a damn large man. I found the exploding bulldozer. Supply loops and schedule. Now! Yes, Kazal! Gentlemen, I apologize. My associate is inelegant. He doesn't understand the fine art of persuasion. Stop! I did not need to see that. to the exit.
think I'll try another way. Get him to clear the opening. Let me know I have these. Get off me! Just give us the wallet! Give it us, man! Help! Hey, leave him alone! Big mistake, kid. You can't just push people around like that. Or what? Like this? Haha. <laughs> Kids right. got guts. Hip squared. What the hell's he saying? Not gonna be saying anything in a second. <laughs> oh! Whoa. You want a taste? Nah, I'm good, kid. I gotta work on my fight banner. Miles? Hey, I've been trying to reach you. You okay? Hey, so, uh, don't freak out, but, um, I gotta fill you in on some stuff. Incredible work, Miles. Stick close to Feast. If the convicts get desperate, they may try to raid the shelter. Way ahead of you. Anything else happens here, I'll let you know. Great. Thanks, Miles. Yuri, figured out Rhino's deal. He's attacking Oscorp's relief centers. I think I know which one he's hitting next. Reports of a possible earthquake and or demolition derby at the Harlem Center. Sounds like our boy. Headed there now. You holding up okay? Tired, but hanging in there. We'll get through this. Keep the faith. What's up? You okay? I'm fine. Coming through Oscorp records. Hey, this is random, but you remember that trip we took to Staten Island with Harry? To find the best pizza in the city? Yeah. 
10 hour odyssey for burnt toast and cold American cheese. How could I forget? Something about all these old Oscorp files made that day pop into my head. Harry was so excited about riding the ferry. It just made me think about how much simpler things were back then. No jobs, no super villains. We could throw away a whole day looking for bad pizza just cuz. Now it feels like if we take a nap, the world will fall apart. Yeah, this adult thing is rough. But I guess the work we do means today's kids can have their own Staten Island adventures. In safety. Kind of a circle of life thing. Circle of bad pizza. <laughs> yeah, you're right. That's a good way to look at it. Thanks, Pete. On your own size, Rhino. There is no one my size, Hulk. Or maybe we could just talk it out. Rhino, what's with the team up? I thought you were a loner. That yeah. Means the damn Hulk. All of life is mean today. for these particular means. Freedom! True freedom! No more shoot! No more rhino! <laughs> Let's wrap this up. Never send an eight-ton infant to do a man's job. Let's finish this. Oh, Scorps, love you, but you do know it's rude to cut in, right? What were you gonna do if I didn't do it? Beg him to give up? Yes, that is exactly what I would have done. Ah, like an old married couple, you two. Get 
in, you idiot! Come down with help! Guys, please! I need to go around! Octavius promise you, Scorpion! Darkin has no principles. He fell off the Untrue! I will strike the face off for free! Pathetic Gargan! I will squash Bog myself! We could just stop now, you know. I won't tell anybody. And leave your skull uncrushed? There is fun in that! Come here now! I will teach you to throw real punch! My jaw's already absorbed that particular lesson, thanks! Rhino's done. Time for Fist of Fury. <laughs> Didn't I hear you took a poetry class in the raft? Like a therapy thing? Do you know what Octavius will do if he finds out you failed? I failed? Yes, you, freak show! Time might help you boys learn to play nice. All right, Yuri, that's four down. Just Octavius and Lee left. Something tells me they won't be as easy. They're only half our problem, though. Devil's breath cases are getting worse, and Oscorp is being coy about an anti serum. I'm worried they're seeing dollar signs in a seller's market. I'd expect nothing less from our beloved mayor. Leave Devil's Breath to me. One of my best people is on it. through the city, state, and federal databases. If this Devil's Breath lab does exist, it's off the books. The only other place I can think to look is in Norman's personal files. I've already been through his office computer. Are you thinking his penthouse? That building's full of Sables, man. If they spot me, other residents could get hurt in a firefight. I know, but I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong, I'll call you for backup. Okay. It's risky, but we need that location. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. I'll be ready. Trying to destroy our power grid. The vulture raining death from above. Spider-Man egging them both on in the very heart of our city, rolling like children. Lethal children, reaching a tantrum of death and destruction. I'm often asked, why do menaces like this end up with awesome powers? Why not someone like you, Jonah? <laughs> well, I have considered trying to use advanced science to give me powers. Only so I could protect you in a more hands-on way, of course. But after much reflection, I've decided against it. Because power corrupts. I'm a man of the people. And I want to stay one of the hard-working, ordinary people of New York. So I'll just help via my talk show, my publishing empire, and my vast personal fortune. No need to thank me. It's what a man of the people does. Okay, MJ. I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble.
Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. Excuse me. The lobby seems pretty busy. Is everything okay? Residents have been asked to temporarily vacate their units while Sable International performs a security sweep. Have people been waiting down here long? No, no. Only one or two hours. We all greatly appreciate Sable International's generous assistance with security. Has the penthouse been affected? Oh my, no. The new security room in the back of the lobby ensures that the mayor remains totally undisturbed. never survive this. Next election, he'll get destroyed. Maybe. I've seen Osborne survive worse. He is a cockroach. Arrogant cockroach. Yeah, that elevator goes straight to his penthouse. I'm sure he's up there right now. There's the security room. But that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs. Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. How come Osborne never has to vacate his apartment for security sweeps? He's got some fancy new system installed in the back security room. No sweeps needed, they say. Plus, you know, he's the mayor. What a jerk. He's definitely lost my <sighs> Left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. The health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. That should do it. Crap. Jerry, get out of here. We got a situation. Oh, man. I can't breathe. Let me back Security up. Security room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said an hour ago. I know this is frustrating, but please remember Sable is doing this for your safety. Hello? I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet you. Okay, okay, I'm gone. Sector clear. Continuing patrol. <sighs> Multi-million dollar building with network speeds from 1995. <sighs> Ridiculous. I like this thing. Gotta turn him around. Continuing sector sweep. What was that? Good boy. I'm sure Sable offers workman's comp. Elevator controls in the security room. Next to the Sable agent. Mary Jane Watson? Super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. 
This is it. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the alarm technician. Fire him. Stupid useless button. Hmm. Norman's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Warning. Fire doors engaged. Automated self-diagnostic commencing. Please remain calm. What is this thing? Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. Whoa, this mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? I wonder where it leads. Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. Work order for keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Doors are locked till the system check finishes. Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> so weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on explaining Pete's powers. Weirder still that Norman is such an active part of it. The Fabulous Osborne Boys. Norman bids his son farewell. Hmm. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Why was Norman so dramatic about a trip to Europe? Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. Self-diagnostic complete. No faults found. Fire doors disengaged. Norman could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Harry's last day. I know he left last summer, but was it July or August? Harry kept a journal. Maybe he recorded the date there. Forgot about this. The Osbournes have a coat of arms and a motto. Pax in bello. Peace in war. Gotta remember that if I ever write a book about all of this. Harry said his mom used to cook all the time. I'd be surprised if Norman has ever even touched the stove. Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michaels for one last shot before the, um... the big trip. 
Uh, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway. Listen, I know I don't say this enough, but... Thank you, Dad. You know, for doing this. I love you. Wow. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so... tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. God, Pete and I loved coming over here to watch movies when we were kids. A different world from Queens. <laughs> Funny how Harry always wanted the opposite. Nothing made him happier than watching cartoons on the little TV in May's kitchen. Norman and Otto. Wow. They look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this? Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Feels like there's something attached to the back of the frame. Score! This must be the key for Harry's room. Norman's bathroom is bigger than my entire apartment. Now I feel sad. Emily's terminal diagnosis. I know Harry's mom was sick, but I had no idea it was genetic. Did Harry ever get tested? This is kind of cute. Norman keeps all the campaign buttons from his races. There's one for school board, and he's left room for more. Setting your sights higher, Norman? I used to be so jealous of Harry's family. They were so happy. At least compared to me and my dad. But when Emily got sick, everything changed. for Harry, can it? Law books. Harry wants to be an environmental attorney. Like his mom. Why didn't you tell us you were sick? Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room.
I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum's ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. Continuing sector sweep. Visual. Moving to confirm. Negative. We're all clear. <sighs> sure could use a coffee. Check it out. Control. Status. Nothing to report.
Running a sweep. Go to alert. We're compromised. Watch your sixes, men. Clear. Nothing to report, Control. July 18. Bingo. Super creepy. Gotta find the location of the Devil's Breath Lab. Something in this room must be useful. What are these things? Prototype hand grenades? Spiders? Is Norman trying to reverse engineer Peter's abilities? The labels on these cages. Bioelectrokinesis, optical camouflage. What the hell is he trying to create?
Foreman Osborne, GR-27 Research Log. The whole project has gone to hell. GR-27 is a cure, not a disease. But try telling that to the evening news. Somehow, they've picked up the technician's morbid nickname, Devil's Breath, and are using it to stoke hysteria. They have no idea what it's really capable of. A cure for cancer, genetic disorders, birth defects. With just a little more research, I know we could perfect it. Instead, I'll spend the next 18 months on PR mop-up. What a waste of time. Devil's Breath isn't a disease. It's an attempt at a cure? I almost can't believe it. Harry and Emily's medical records. GR-27 was developed to treat them. Devil's Breath is a failed cure for Norman's own family. medical records. GR-27 was developed to treat them. Devil's Breath is a failed cure for Norman's own family. Wow. Norman wins the fancy map contest. Looks like Norman's tracking Dr. Michael's movements. Creep fest. Mm, kinda makes sense, though. Michael's is the lead on Devil's Breath. Huh. This shows all of Oscorp's properties. I had no idea they owned so much of New York. Sable troop deployments. They're stationed all over the city. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of Sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michaels. Oscorp building, but no Michaels or Sable. None of these patrols cross Dr. Michael's path. Nope, that's just a Sable patrol. Dr. Michaels went to this Oscorp building, but there's no security detail. Don't think I've chosen the right categories. None of these patrols cross Dr. Michael's path. Bet I'm looking for a heavily guarded Oscorp building that Dr. Michaels visits. Oscorp building, but no Michaels or Sable. That's not it. Commercial buildings. Wow. So many records facilities. Oscorp's going all in on defense research. No. A records facility could be perfect cover for the Devil's Breath Lab. Bravo, bravo, bravo. GR-27. That's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it. Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that... I knew it. Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR-27 Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I... We'll be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. What have you done? 
Oh my god. Norman and Otto. They started all of this. They created Lee. I, I have to get this. Who's there? We have a breach. High alert. Pete, I've got the lab location. And a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. Control. Who's there? Hey. Wait! I've got an intruder. Pete, I've got the lab location. And a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. Sweep complete. Sector clear. Check it out. Copy that. Stand by, Control. I heard something. Look alive! We-
Sweep complete. Sector clear. Need to clear that balcony. You're amazing. It's all so much to take in. Harry sick, Norman and Lee, and Dr. Octavius? I know. This is all my fault. No, not this song again. You are not alone anymore, Pete. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You, you find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks, partner. to get that anti-serum and start putting things right. There must be some way to reach Leonardo. Convince them to give up this crusade for revenge. They've both done so much good for the world. They can't throw their legacies away just to spite Norman. Okay, Norman's on his way to get the anti-serum. Better update Yuri. I hope this is good news. It is. Oscorp just created an anti-serum. There's a cure? Oh, thank God. How quickly can we get it to people? I'm on my way to find out. The lab is at 10th and Cathedral. Wait. I just got a report of a helicopter going down in that area. Oh, no. That could be Norman's helicopter. I'd send officers your way, but I don't have any. Don't worry. I'm on it. This will all be over soon. I promise.
open it. these demons before I can follow Lee into the lab. Time to KO those snipers. Easier to take these guys out if they split up. Need to get through these demons quick before Lee gets a hold of the anti serum. Here. They're not handling anything. You have been warned, superhero. Sable made good on her threat, but these guys aren't looking to team up. I'm tired of you harassing our agents, Spider-Man. This ends tonight. You guys think I took out your men? You gotta be kidding me! Get him to the ground! <laughs> I wish Sable would cut me some slack. We should be on the same team. Demons and Sable are down. Time to follow Lee inside. Why are you so heavy? You harass my men. 
destroy my equipment and cost my client millions. Give me one good reason I should not kill you right now. Listen, I don't like you, you don't like me. But Lee has your client inside this building right now and he's gonna kill him if we don't do something. We could fight each other, or we could fight Lee, but not both. I mean, we're good? You will help me secure Norman. After that, I make no promises. Works for me. Lee's out of control. Oh. You secure Osborne. I will talk to them. Oh. Oh. friends. Okay, Lee. No more running. This ends tonight. Find a way to reach the Martin Lee I know. The man who built Feast. No way to go but down. Make my parents proud to honor their legacy. But to truly honor them, Osborne must see justice. I won't let you do this, Martin. sample. You, Martin! Don't let revenge win. Fight it! Osborne must be punished! 
infected this city for too long. Osborne deserves true justice. He won't see it unless he stop now. I'll never stop. be over soon. I sure hope so.
My will is stronger than yours! We'll see about that. Can't give up. He's almost down. is the wrong way, Martin. on your face. You can't imagine how satisfying it is. Ready for your final act? not worry about him right now. He needs a hospital. No. No hospital. Feast. I need to speak to your head doctor. There's no doctors here. Well, who's running this place? Me, mostly. Oh, okay. Well, it's been a while, but I'll do my best. I'll need masks, uh, gloves, right. whatever you have to sterile. Thank you. You can thank me by not dying. Oh my god.
He'll live. But he needs rest. Say she could go at any moment. Where are you going? I need to find Otto. He has the anti serum. <laughs> Anyone can find a weakness, it's him. Go get him, Tiger. MJ's right. I built the neural interface. That means I can destroy it. There must be something at the lab I can use. I'm actually gonna miss you and your death troopers. Unfortunately, my agents will stay. Though I question our work, they do not. And Osborne continues to pay. I am sorry. So close to being good news. Indeed. I will miss you and your bizarre witticism, Spider-Man. Until we meet again. What a strange, violent lady.
You did the impossible, Doc. But now I have to destroy it. With a little creation of my own. to beg? Not gonna happen! <laughs> the world will know the truth before they mop you off the pavement. Go! Oh! Tell them what you did! I... never... Oh! Everything you have is built on lies! Lies! Ah! You stole my company, my ideas. Now, the truth. The truth. Okay. The truth is, you were only ever worth a damn when you worked for me. The truth is, you could never accept that I'm better than you. You're a failure, Otto, and you always will be. Otto, you've worked your whole life to help people. Please. You're fighting the wrong man. But have it your way. We don't have much time! Please! I'll turn over the anti serum when Osborne pays for his crime! <laughs>
are dying! They need the anti-serum now! I will cure the city after I bring down Osborne! Save the city! Then we can do whatever you want! I already know what I want! Now get out of my way before I really hurt you! How much is Osborne paying you to protect him? I'm not protecting him! I'm trying to save the city! Let you win. This means too much to me. Not more than it means to me. Peter, 
Then I guess you'll have to save yourself! Oh, my hero! You meant so much to me! You look tired, Parker. Not tired. Just hurt. If you want to change the world, you have to be the kind of man who can make the hardest decisions. <gasps> I couldn't agree more! I saw you as a son. I should have known you'd turn on me. Just like all the others. Turn. Turn? I've worshipped you. Your mind. Your conscience. Wanting to help others. The way you never gave up. That's because men like us have a duty. A responsibility. To use our talents in the service of others. Even if they don't appreciate it. We have to do what's best for those beneath us. Whether they understand it or not. No, you're wrong! You are everything I wanted to be! You just threw it away! Yes, of course. You're right, Peter. Oh. I see that now. The neural interface affected my mind. But I can fix it. We can fix it together. If you'll help me. I'll do everything I can. I'll make sure you get the best help. No! If they put me away, they'll take my arms! I'll be trapped in this useless body! Please, Peter. That wasn't me. You said you'd never abandon me. You promised. Remember? And of course, you rest easy, knowing your secret is safe with me. You do what you think is best, Doc. It's all any of us can. Peter? Even when it hurts like hell. Peter, where are you going? Peter?
It's still viable. We'll need the entire sample as a base to produce more doses. How long will that take? A few hours. Maybe a day. What if we use it to cure someone right now? Then there won't be enough to cure the others. I'll give you a few minutes. You're gonna be okay, ma'am. I've got the cure right here. Take off your mask. I want to see my nephew. You knew? I've known for a while. I never wanted you to worry. I did. And I am so proud of you. And Ben would be too. All the people you've saved. I don't know what to do. Yes, you do. So? Hi. Mary Jane Watson, associate editor. Congrats. Thank you. I knew you could do it. <laughs> what about you? Find a job yet? Oh, no, but, uh... I'll be right with you, honey. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I was actually considering maybe a career change. Hmm? Yeah, I think I might want to become a chef. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, it's... You're a scientist. A good one. You know, the last project I worked on, I created a monster octopus that almost destroyed the city, so... Yeah. 
I mean, you do make a hell of a chicken curry. <laughs> I do. <laughs> Still working on my dumplings, though. Going camping? Oh, uh, my uh, new place isn't going to be ready for about a week, so I'm going to be crashing with Miles for the next few nights. Oh. You know, you can always stay at my place. Only if you want to. No, I, I, mean, I, mean, I mean, yes, I mean, no, no, I don't I not want to, but meaning I, I, I do want to, but only if you do. I never stopped wanting to. Me neither. I'm not an expert or anything, but I think it's in the way that you ask her. Uh, I'm getting too nervous. <laughs> hey, all right, so where do you want this? Uh, right over here is fine. All right. Hey, so Pete? Yeah? I, uh, kind of got to talk to you about something I can't tell my mom about. What's up? Well, um, weird things have been going on. Like, physically. Oh. 
Oh. Uh. Well, you know, you're at that age where where your your body starts to change, and so you may be noticing some areas. No. For example, not that. Uh. Things. Things. Better that I just um. I show you. I show no, you. No. 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 It's pretty weird, right? Not that weird.
so close. But I'll keep trying. I will find a cure. I will. I love you, son. Officers respond. Witness report of an active drug deal. Any officers near Madison proceed to the crime scene. Curry, you're back. How's your mom? Fine. Right back to complaining about not having grandchildren. So, you gonna take that vacation now? Are you crazy? There's no time for that. The apocalypse didn't happen, which means we've got a city full of loose ends to clean up. Sounds like a big job, but we're up to it. Not you. For a job this tough, we need Spider Cop. <laughs> you, you said it! You even did the voice! Okay, don't make it weird. You like me! You really like me! You made it you never weird. The ground. Let's go, we've got work to do. I can't wait. Spider Cop surveys the city. Placid, but seething with turmoil just beneath its calm surface. Uh, what have I done?
Fisk brought all the small-timers out of the woodwork. 